When I think about the wilderness of Denali, I think of vastness and how small we are in that great big wintry world. Sled dogs are not the National Park Service's idea. This is an idea that we have adopted from everyone else who knew that dog teams were just the best, most reliable, and I'd argue most fun way to travel around Alaska in winter. So I'm the kennels manager in Denali National Park and Preserve. And I'm in charge of the only sled dog kennel in the entire National Park Service. In 1980, the original park boundary was designated as wilderness and officially designated wilderness is the highest level of federal land protection available. And it means that you can't use any motorized form of transport to travel. It's all gonna be through non-motorized transport. So dog teams, skis, snowshoes, anything like that. Let me see your teeth. These dogs are all Alaskan Huskies, born and raised for thousands of years to live in the harsh winter conditions of Alaska and to want to run and pull a sled. Asking me my favorite dog is like asking a parent their favorite child. <laughs> it's not possible to answer that question. They all win my heart in some way or another. These guys are amazing. They bridge the gap to the wild. I think the dogs are just an incredible invitation and inspiration for our visitors. We're all a part of this wilderness. We're all a part of this place. And it has so much to offer us if we're willing to go out and be challenged by it a little to immerse ourselves in it.